Oh man, what kind of video am I gonna do today? Ugh, my soldier senses are tingling. That can only mean one thing. Christopher Chaos is gonna put on the army uniform? Ugh, ugh. It has been a really long time since I've worn an army uniform. Now, I did at one point in time, a long time ago, put on my old uniform. It was the ACU pattern uniform, but I was pretty skinny in the army. So that uniform did not fit very well. It was pretty snug and everything like that. Uh, I've worn different types of uniforms. I've worn the BDUs, the battle dress uniform. I've worn the DCUs, the desert camouflage uniform. And I've worn the ACUs, the, what was that one? What was that one? The army combat uniform, right? Which was the digital pattern. The current version of the army uniform, the OCPs, I think they're still kind of calling it the ACUs, the army combat uniform, I don't know. But anyways, the current pattern of it, that one was starting to come into play as I was getting out of the army. So I never wore that version of the uniform. I'm curious as to like, what, what will it be like wearing an army uniform again? I'm not gonna shave though, so we're not gonna be AR 670-1 compliant, but I'm curious. I'm curious as to what it would look like current day, Chris, in an army uniform with current army uniform, just minus the shaving part, because let's not get too crazy with it. So I got one, I got a uniform, we're gonna put it on, we're gonna see how this bad boy looks. So I have everything here, I got a, a belt that I actually normally just use normally, but it would work for the army uniform. I got the undershirt, which I think is still a compliant undershirt. I don't know, it doesn't matter. I got the pants, I got the top, and I got Boots. These boots, however, are not AR 670-1 compliant because you cannot have zippers on the side. But it's not a big deal, right? We're just gonna do that. The only thing I don't have is headgear, so yes, you're gonna see chaos without a hat on. Not a big deal. Let's not make a big deal out of this thing. If you've seen some really old videos, I used to not wear a hat a lot in those videos, so I'm not gonna make a big deal out of it. Are you? You probably are. Okay. Anyways, let's put these uniform on. Let's see how this kind of kind of goes and how it works. Here we are. It's weird. <laughs> this, is, this uniform is probably a little big on me. Uh, probably could be a size smaller. Would probably have been a better fit. But uh, it's definitely weird. Like like when I look down, it looks weird seeing the camouflage pattern on the uniform and you know being in uniform again. Uh, looking in the mirror, it looks a little weird because I feel like it looks a little bit too big. Uh, like it needs to be a little bit size smaller. I actually ordered this size. It was actually the size above what I used to wear but I think these uniforms run a little bit larger than the regular ones do. So I probably could have ordered the same size that I used to wear instead of doing this one. Cause I used to do medium long was the uniform I used to wear. And this one is a large long. So I ended up wearing actually, yeah, something like that. So I ended up going a little bit bigger, but I probably could have just stuck with the same size for this particular brand. This brand is not the specific one they sell inside the clothing sales. It's like an off brand or not really off brand, but it's, it's a good brand, but it's not the one they sell in clothing sales. It is apparently military spec. That's actually the name of the company, but it's apparently AR671 compliant, apparently. I didn't really look into it too much to see, but yeah. How about that, huh? <laughs> Technically, these patches actually on here are ACU pattern uh, patches, not the OCP patches, but I have my last unit from 4th ID and then the unit I deployed with for my first tour, which was 30 ACR. I actually deployed with 4th ID as well, but. I always liked having the first unit I deployed with, and this is actually the AR flag for the infrared one. Um, but I didn't, I probably have a regular one around somewhere, but I just threw that one on because that one was easy to find. Patches wise, they're, they're all good. Uh, Chaos, totally my real last name. I get that as a question a lot. It's not, it's not my real last name, but I'm not gonna tell you that. You can find it out very easy though. It's not that hard. I just don't like really necessarily disclosing it, but Chaos is not my real last name, but it, it looks cool, right? How about that? Huh? Chaos Army over here, Sergeant Rank. So there you go. So your question might be why? Why did you get an Army uniform? Well, 
there's a lot of things I want to use it for. The pants are really comfortable, so I definitely will, will want to use the pants for like road marches, for working out in, for like road marching and hiking in, because uh, they're really comfortable to do that kind of thing. And plus, they have the cargo pockets and everything. So, I'll probably use that for that portion. The top will probably just be used, be used for like video stuff. I might do some future video stuff where I do some skit type of related things or just other fun stuff where I'm wearing a, a top. So. Wearing the complete uniform, this is maybe the only time or other rare times where I'll be ever doing it with the complete uniform. But otherwise, it'll be like in sections. I wanted to be able to use it for other things. So like the top for some stuff and then the pants uh, for a few other things and stuff. So, yeah. Now, my girlfriend has never seen me in the army uniform. Uh, we weren't together when I was in the army. She saw me when I tried in my uniform that one time from an old one, but it was kind of looked stupid because it was kind of tight and too small for me. But, and this one's now too big for me. By the way, I've also uh, just, while I was kind of, in between doing this and the other thing I was just doing, but returning this one and getting a smaller size so that way it fits a little bit better because this is just way too baggy. But anyways, back to what I was saying. My girlfriend has never seen me in the army uniform, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to kind of surprise her and just see what she thinks, get her reaction from that. And uh, we'll do a little uh, prank of uh, I'm joining the army prank. No, I'm just kidding. Not really, that's stupid. <laughs> so we're just gonna kind of surprise her and see what she thinks of, you know, see me in especially like this uniform for the very first time. We'll see how that goes. Hi baby. Hi, what are you doing? Nothing, going to work. Why do you look like that? <laughs> what do you think? I'm so glad we're so over this face and I don't have to worry about deployments or anything like that. But you look super hot and I'm on my lunch break. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... <laughs> All right, so there you go. First time wearing the army uniform in a really, really long time, and definitely the first time actually wearing this version of the uniform. Because, like I said, I, I never had the OCPs. So there you go. Uh, probably utilize it for future versions. The, obviously, the other version of the uniform that I get in the mail uh, later on, because I'm returning this one because it's too big. So I'll get a better size one, and then maybe like some fun little skit kind of things, or maybe just some little things where it pops up in between, like a regular video where all of a sudden it's army Chris or army chaos and then you know civilian chaos and I don't know we'll, we'll figure something out but I definitely wanted to do something kind of fun you know I, I see like you know other content creators that do some fun stuff with their old uniforms and everything like that and I wanted it to be more current I could bust out some old ones but I feel like they're too small I don't know we'll see but you know have a little bit of fun and kind of mix things up and be more creative that's what this video is in, in the first place not teaching anything just something kind of fun hopefully enjoyed it obviously it's gonna not hit as many people you know as far as viewers as my regular videos but that's all right it's just kind of fun going outside the box and you know entertaining those of you hardcore individuals that are really interested in just the, the daily Christopher chaos stuff the outside of just teaching you stuff and some of the more fun entertaining things like trying on the army uniform for the first time in a long time so so if you did come and stick around and hang around for the video and you enjoyed it, hit that thumbs up for me, really appreciate it. Check out links down in the description. I even got the uh, the link to if you want to get like this uniform kind of a thing, the true spec from Amazon helps out the channel. So check that out, including like the, I think, I don't know, maybe the boots might be down there, but uh, the belt probably down there too. So if you want to check that stuff out, check that out. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Christopher Chaos. See you next time. See ya.